Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's Golf and Elungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos each and every day so if there's something that you guys want us to do drop us a link in the comment section below and we'll do it for you you can check out our second youtube channel called funny and just see 2.0 you guys can head there subscribe and enjoy our weekly content we've got a podcast called diving in with funny and jesse and we have some amazing conversations which you guys don't want to miss you can find us on itunes spotify podbean this channel or our second youtube channel channel We've got a Patreon and well, we go by the name Funny and Jesse. You guys can check it out, become members, and we'll appreciate a big shout out to everyone that has subscribed to our channel. Thank you for subscribing, thank you for liking, thank you for sharing, thank you for always commenting, and just thank you for everything. You guys are the best. I hope you guys are doing all right and may you stay blessed. So, today I'm going to be reacting to a Dr. Zakina. I don't know why the title is not showing but yeah so without wasting time let's get into the video that if all the muslims they believe in the same allah they follow the same quran they believe in the same prophet then why are muslims divided into sects the reply to this question is given the glorious quran in Surah al imran Chapter number three, verse number 103, where Allah says, Wa atasimu bihabnillahi jamia wa atafarku. Hold to the rope of Allah strongly and be not divided. The double emphasis. Hold to the rope of Allah strongly, the second emphasis, and be not divided. The rope of Allah, it is the glorious Quran. Allah says, Hold to the rope of Allah, that is the glorious Quran, and be not divided. Allah says, Atiyu Allah, Atiyu Rasul. Obey Allah and obey the Messenger. In Surah Nisa chapter 4, 59. So, we have to strongly hold to Allah and the sayings of the Prophet and be not divided. Allah says in the Quran in Surah Anam, chapter number 6, verse number 159, that if anyone breaks their religions and divides the religion of Islam into sects, O Prophet, you have nothing to do with him. Allah will look after his affairs. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is telling that if anyone breaks his religion into sects and divides his religion, O oh Prophet, you have nothing to do with him. Allah will look after his affairs on the day of judgment. But when we ask the Muslim, normally, what are you? So some say, I'm a Sunni. Some say, I'm a Shia. Some say, Hanafi. Some say Shafi, some say Hamali, some say Malki, some say Deobandi, some say Barevli, some say Eliadis, some say Salafi, some say jamaat e islami some say Tabliki. What was the beloved Prophet? What was he? Was he Hanafi? Was he Shafi? Was he Hamali? What was he? What was he? He was a Muslim. Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Al Imran, chapter number 3, verse number 52, Isa salam was a Muslim. Allah says in Surah Al Imran, chapter number 3, verse 67, that Ibrahim, peace be upon him, was not a Jew or a Christian, he was a Muslim. And Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Fusilat, chapter 41, verse number 33, Woman Hassan Nukala Mimman Doyla Lahi, Wamil Salihon, Kala Innani Minil Muslimi, who is better in speech than one who invites to the way of thy Lord, works righteousness, and sees that I am a a Muslim call in the name in a Muslim and says that I am a Muslim and the master key for Dawah which I mentioned in several verses of the Quran in several of my lectures the master key of Dawah and the most important verse according to me in the Quran of Sulay al-Imran chapter 3 verse number 64 is pull yahil kitab say people of the book ta'ala wila kalimatin sawa in bayna baynakum come to common terms as in us and you which is the first term Allah na'bu da illa Allah that we worship none but Allah. That we associate the partners with Him. That we erect not among ourselves lords and patrons other than Allah. Find Allah. If then they turn back. Say we bear witness. We are not Muslim. That we are Muslims bowing our will to Allah. I am a Muslim. We are Muslim. No less than 22 places in the Quran. Allah says, call yourself a Muslim. Call yourself a Muslim. Ibrahim al-Salam. 
in Surah Hajj, chapter 22. When he did dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he told that, make my children Muslims. All these aimas, all these great scholars of Islam, the four aimas, Imam Abu Hanifa, Imam Abu bin Hanbal, Imam Malik, Imam Shafi, may Allah have mercy on them all. May Allah be pleased with them all. I love them, I respect them all. All these are great scholars of Islam. All of them. When you ask them, if you ask Abu Hanifa, may Allah be pleased with him. Who are you? What reply will he give? What will he say? I'm a Muslim. We love these scholars, we respect these scholars. All the scholars said that if you find any of my fatwa which goes against Allah and His Rasul, you throw my fatwa on the wall. We love these scholars, we respect them, but all of them came to get us closer to Islam to make us a practicing Muslim, not divide our religion. Allah says in the Quran in Surah Nisa, chapter 4, verse 59, Ya Allazina Amanu, O you believe, Atiullah, what you Rasul, obey Allah. And obey the messenger and those who have been charged with authority who have been charged with authority amongst you so people say believe in Allah believe in the message messenger and believe in the scholars but they're putting a full stop where there's no full stop the verse does not end there the verse continues obey Allah and obey the messengers and those who have been charged with authority, the ulama, the scholars, but if they differ, go back to Allah and His Rasul. If they differ, if any scholar, if you find all the scholars say the same thing, you don't have to do research. All say pray five times, no problem. All say fast, no problem. But if two scholars differ, you go back to Allah and His Rasul. Where is the question of dividing the religion? That's why beloved Prophet Muhammad said, it's a Sahih Hadith of Sunan Abu Dawood, Hadith number 4579. Our beloved Prophet said, there will be 73 sects in Islam. But mind you, so people say, Prophet has prophesied. The Prophet said there will be. The Prophet didn't say make. The Prophet said there will be 73 sects. Prophet did not say you should make sects in Islam. Allah clearly mentioned in Surah Anam chapter 6 verse 159, do not make sex in the religion of Islam. The Prophet predicted there will be 73 sex. He didn't say you should make. There's another hadith, a Sahih hadith in Tirmidhi, hadith number 171. A beloved Prophet Muhammad said that there will be 73 sex in Islam out of which all will go to hell except one. The Sahaba asked which one? He said, those that follow me and my companions, those that follow Quran and the authentic hadith. So if you stick to the Quran and the Sahih hadith, you are on the straight path. So in Islam, there is no divisions and no sects in Islam. Islam is only one. The Quran is one. Our beloved Prophet is one. We have to follow the Quran and the authentic sayings of Prophet Muhammad I really wonder what causes um, division, but throughout this time I was thinking, so if there's all this division and different sectors, is it that there's some that believe the Quran, but don't believe the Hadiths, or some that believe the Hadiths and don't believe the Quran, what is it exactly, what is it, where does the difference come in, where is the difference coming in from? And is it, another thing is, my second question is, is it that they've chosen certain parts of the Quran and don't believe parts of it, or maybe they interpret it? That's what I'm trying to understand. A big shout out to the person that suggested this. Thank you for bringing this across me. Really, really appreciate. At the end of the day, I like the fact that he said, as long as you believe, don't, I guess, Always define yourself as a Muslim. Don't believe in this, in the division. Otherwise, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in my next reaction video.
Bajin, 